developing at noon, a deadly discovery after a car went up in flames in Pompano Beach today. The deputies responded. They did find a body inside, and local 10 News reporter Joseph Ojo is live for us at that scene. He has the latest on the investigation. Joseph. And these neighbors tell us this really did come as a surprise. They say this is a very, very quiet neighborhood, but the investigation is going on right now behind those deputy cars that you do see. Deputies at this time trying to figure out who started this car fire and how an adult body was found in the back seat of that car. Cell phone video capturing a massive car fire in Pompano Beach. You can see the car engulfed in flames as thick, dark smoke shoots into the air. Neighbors even seen coming outside watching in disbelief. This man tells us in Spanish he heard what sounded like an explosion, went to his window to look outside and then saw the burning car. Sky 10 flying above the scene showing the aftermath. You can see the charred white SUV with heavy damage to the body of the car as well as foam on the ground surrounding the SUV. The large crime scene blocking off the area near Northwest 2nd Terrace and Northwest 32nd Court. Our cameras capturing a massive deputy presence on scene as well as several firefighters working the blaze. At approximately 6.30 a.m. this morning, um, Pompano Beach Fire Rescue got a 911 call in reference to a car on fire. When fire crews arrived to the scene, not only was the car on fire, a nearby dumpster was as well. They put out the fire, but then realized an adult body was in the back seat of the car. Firefighters arrived. They found a fully involved car. Homicide and crime scene investigators on scene trying to piece this all together, and the state fire marshal also responding to the scene. Neighbors shocked at the sight of it all, saying it's scary to think this can happen where they live. No, was that miedo? And we did hear from that PIO that this is actually being looked at as a possible homicide. No word yet on the, the body that was in that car has not yet been identified and no word yet on any suspect or suspects in this case. Once we do learn any more information, we'll be sure to let you know. We're here in Pompano Beach. I'm Joseph Ojo, Local 10 News.